Hi, my name is Lisa Larson. I'm going to be your instructor today. What you may ask is, am I going to be instructing you on? Well, let me tell you. I'm going to instruct you how to change the lens on your DSLR camera. What's a DSLR camera? You don't know? It's a di digital single lens reflex camera. It means that you've got more than one lens for it. Some lenses are really good for those telephoto shots, other ones for macros or up close shots, and some are for somewhere in between. Now, I don't have any of those really big long lenses like you see on the pro circuit, you know, at the, at the NFL games or whatever. You see those guys get those really long lenses. Looks like it takes three people to hold it. Don't have anything that good. But I do have a whole bunch of different cameras. The one I'm going to show you today, I have right here in my little bag. And my bag is always with me. If this bag isn't with me with my camera in it, I have one of my smaller cameras along. Because you're never going to catch me without a camera. So, first thing I do, open up my camera bag, take my camera out. Second thing I do, camera strap around the neck. Camera strap goes around your neck so you don't drop this thing because it's expensive. Okay? Now, before you change the lens on your camera, what you need to do is find the on and off switch, and every camera has one, and you turn it off. You want to make sure it's off because that little digital sensor in there when it's turned on, it attracts dust. And then you get those little spots on your pictures and you're going, wow, where in the heck did that come from? Yeah, it's because you left your camera on. So, camera's off, I can tell. It's in the off position, okay? Every camera is gonna have some kind of a little button or something that you need to push. Mine happens to be a Nikon, so it has a little button right next to the lens. I push that little button in Get a really good grip on your lens. You don't want to drop it. These things cost a fortune. Twist it. In my case, I twist it clockwise. Pull it off. Now, this part of the camera, expensive part, this is where all the digital sensors and everything are. Keep it tilted down. If you keep it tilted up, all that dust that's falling out of the sky, bird droppings, whatever happens to be above you, it's going to end up in your camera. Not a good thing. Cost a fortune to get it cleaned. I'm going to take my old lens and I'm gonna put it in my bag, reach into my bag, get the lens that I wanna change it to off, and I'm gonna to have to kinda of hold my camera in kind of a weird position, but it's just so it's still going down. Twist off the safety cap on my new lens. In the real world, I'd just probably toss it in my pocket. In this case, I'm sticking it in my bag. Take my lens, put it on. Sometimes you have to kinda of Turn it around a little bit until you get just the right position. It'll pop in. Twist it a little bit till I hear a click. There's my click. Kind of tug on it a little bit. That way I know my lens is secure. Before you take a picture, two more things you gotta do. One, turn your camera on. Two, take the lens cap off. If you leave the lens cap on, you get a lot of black pictures, nothing else. Okay? Now, I'm gonna take a picture of you taking a picture of me. Thank you very much. My name again is Lisa Larson. If you have any questions, feel free to contact me. My email is kidsnurse, K-I-D-S-N-U-R-S-E, at Mac, M-A-C, just like the computer, dot com. That's kidsnurse at Mac.com. Thanks a lot. Bye.